I really don't need to introduce Billy Bragg, so I will just hand over the microphone to someone who knows how to use it better than me. Well, here we are. This is exciting, isn't it? Yeah. In the sense it hasn't rained. <laughs> Come gather round, people, wherever you roam And admit that the waters around you have grown And accept it that soon, you'll be drenched to the bone For the climate is obviously changing But the fool in the White House says no one's to blame For the times they are a-changing back Come Mexicans, Muslims, LGBT and Jews And keep your eyes wide for what's on the news But President Trump is expressing his views And I fear that the mob he's inciting Will soon break your windows and burn down your schools but the times they are a-changing back and daughters throughout the land a bunch of old men have come up with a plan so forget your ambitions but they've a better idea about how you should be behaving so get back in the kitchen and button your lip for the times they are a changing back of the free and the home of the brave Martin Luther King is spinning in his grave to see a bigoted bully taking the stage and he calls upon us to be faithful to the ideals he died for in another age for the times they are a changing back line that is drawn and the curse that is cast and the slow one now will later be fast as the present now will later be past let's hold on to that idea for a moment and the first one now will later be last for the times they need a Jacqueline, but on a picket line in Cambridge, I see a different scene. Everybody's wondering just where the country's going. I think that we're up the creek, our neuroses are showing. Cause the truth is that Britain has grown tired of being great, so it's going back to being Little England. Soviet Union, the citizens demand to know why they're still the target of strategic air command. And they shake their fists in anger and respectfully suggest we take that money from Trident and spend it on the NHS. <laughs> Trump is fond of bending countries to his will. He just slaps on the tariffs and pushes up their bills. But if Brexit comes to no deal, you know, we will be the first people who voted to put sanctions on themselves. What the heck is that about? 
No one knows how many children Boris Johnson sired Or can remember how many times these lies have got him fired But I can tell you this mate I know how this will end When he does to Britain what he's done to his ex-girlfriends Jungle sales are organised All my mates got fat even after all this time, you can still send me a fax. You can be active. We be activists or sleeping with the media while you're waiting for the great leap forwards. Our one leap forwards still is back. Let's all just give the Tories the sack. Yes! Yeah! Yeah! comes the future and you can't run from it you've got a picket line i want to be on it waiting for the great leap forwards in a perfect world we'd all sing in tune but there ain't nobody that can sing like me way over <laughs> you in the minor key well if no one out there understands start your own bloody podcast and cut out the middleman <laughs> Every boss has got one. <laughs> so join the struggle while you may. The revolution's just a strike away. <laughs> when we're all waiting for the great leap This government had an idea and Parliament made it law. It looks like it's illegal to fight for the unions anymore. And which side are you on? 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 Yeah! Set off to join the picket lines, but together we cannot fail. We got stopped by police at the county line. They said, "Go on, boys, or you're going to jail." Which side are you on? Which side are you on? Which side are you on? Which side are you? On? It's hard to explain to a crying child why her mummy won't go back. So the family suffer, but it hurts me more to hear a scab say, Sod you, Jack. And which side are you on? 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 Well, I'm bound to follow my conscience. Whatever I can, but it would take much more than a union law to knock the fight out of a working family. Which side are you on? 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 Which side are you? Great uh, being out here in the sunshine, the November sunshine with you. We don't get much of that. I think it lines. Uh, I hear at Sedgwick on the other side, they've got a brazier going over there. And they're making marshmallows. That's my kind of picket line. <laughs> I'll be there if you want to look for me. Which side? I was on the wrong side, obviously, at Sedgwick this morning. But a uh, number of people there and here have uh, come to say hello to me, shake my hand, and. Uh, Grab a selfie, and in the in the in the process of that, thank me for being here. I'm supposed to be. I'm Billy Bragg. It's my job. <laughs> this is what I do. You know. I'm a follower of a guy named Woody Guthrie, and uh, you know Woody in his career in the 1930s, the 1940s, he never did a gig like I'm doing tonight at the junction with a PA and lights and. The, 500 people paying tickets and, and selling t-shirts. He never did those kind of gigs at all. 
the kind of gigs he did were just like this, playing on picket lines, playing in uh, uh, solidarity meetings, these kind of things. And if I was just singing his songs, I wouldn't be true to his legacy. So I'm very, very proud to be here today to support all of you in this strike and to see the rest of you here expressing your solidarity. Because that's what music can do. Music can't change the world. Don't argue with me, I've been doing it 35 years, all right? <laughs> it can't change the world, it has no agency. But what it can do is bring people together like it does here. This is the role that music has. It's able to focus people, bring, bring them together to express their solidarity. So I want to thank all of you who've come down here today for being here. You don't have to be here. I do, because like I say, it's my job to be here. Because, <laughs> you know, we live in incredibly cynical times. You know, just switching on your, your iPhone, looking at your news feed, picking up what's going on on social media, reading the newspapers like old geezers like me do, watching the news. It's enough to make anybody want to stay in bed. And the cynicism that is our greatest enemy, those of us who want to make the world a better place, is our own cynicism. Our own sense that no one gives a monkey's about. Our own sense that nothing will ever change. This turnout today and this strike and the solidarity expressed here proves that is wrong. People do care about these things. People are getting organised, not just here in Cambridge, but right across the country. And on a number of levels as well, especially with the election coming. You know, there's never been a greater time to be out and be active. And why is that important? Because there is no better antidote to cynicism than activism. So thank you all for coming in here today. Thank you for your support for the UCU strikers. Thank you those of you for coming to Solidarity. My name's Billy Bragg, this is my song. There is power in a factory, power in the land, power in the hand of the worker. But it all amounts to nothing if together we don't stand there. Union. Yeah. Now the lessons of the past were all learned with workers' blood The mistakes of the bosses we must pay for From the cities and the farmlands to trenches full of mud War has always been the bosses' way, sir The Union forever defending our rights Down with the black leg workers' unite our brothers and our sisters, together we will stand there. There's power in a union. Yeah. Now I long for the morning that they realise brutality and unjust laws can not defeat us. Who'll defend the workers who cannot organise when the bosses send their lackeys out to cheat us? He speaks for money, the devil for his own. Who comes as before the skin and the bone? What a comfort to the widow, a lie to the child. There is power in a union. The union forever, we go. The union forever, defending our rights. Down with the black little work as she writes. With our brothers and our sisters, together we will. The union forever defending our rights Down with the black little workers unite With our brothers and our sisters from many far off lands There is power in a union There is power in a This is an old, old struggle, this is an old, old fight. 
and for some of you who are just starting and it's maybe the first time you've been involved in a struggle. The great tradition that I'm part of, that the miners were part of, that Woody was part of, you are part of that tradition now. Whatever you're bringing with it, whatever songs you write, whatever chants you bring, whatever vibe you bring, you are part of that tradition now. And all the tradition asks is, is that you pass that on, you pass that solidarity on, you pass that compassion on. That is what our fight is about, ultimately, fundamentally. It's about compassion. It's about empathy. It's about everybody together. Let's finish off with a, a verse on the chorus of one of them really, really old, 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 old songs. When the union's inspiration through the workers' blood shall run, there shall be no power greater anywhere beneath the sun. For what force on earth is weaker than the feeble strength of one? But the union makes us strong. Solidarity forever! Solidarity forever! Solidarity forever! Solidarity forever!